Alright guys, so today we have another M2. Uh, the single M2 videos seem to be pretty popular and I have nothing else going on. So that seems to be a pretty good thing to do right now. So this is the M2 1968 Ford Mustang GT Ford Performance Edition. These are special edition ones. Um, they come into O'Reilly Auto Parts every month or so, I think they get some. And I'm sure you can find them other places as well, but that's where, that's where I've been getting them. Of course, M2 put the same wheels on this. They've been putting on about everything recently. I'm kind of sick of seeing the wheels, actually. They're not bad wheels, I'm just tired of seeing them. They've been putting them on everything. So of course we're gonna open this up here and we may not even have to cut the sticker on it. It looks like the uh, sticker's not stuck on there real good except I just sealed it back up with my thumb. Yep, there you go. Don't even have to uh, cut anything there. You know, as long as we don't rip the box trying to open this up, we'll be all good. So this one seems to roll pretty good. It rolls a little smoother than the uh, Plymouth that we had in the last video, which didn't roll bad. It just had a wobbly back wheel, so it kind of was loud. So this one's kind of an interesting color scheme on it. Now, in most things, I would say this color scheme doesn't really look that good, but it works on this car. It kind of follows the body lines a little bit. Yeah, the, it just, for some reason, it works on this car. So it says Ford, and then Ford Performance on the door. Got the big Cobra head on the fender. Got Goodyear tires. Come around back, forward on the license plate there. Got your tail lights and reverse lights painted in. Oop, about dropped it. Same stuff on this side. I think the um, Ford Performance thing works better on this side. I think the uh, Ford emblem should have still went on the fender, and then Ford Performance would have been on the door. It just kind of doesn't seem very centered on this side at a crooked door as well but anyway I thought the windows looked kind of foggy from the outside they are quite foggy not real clear you can see the in interior though it's your dashboard and your steering wheel just basic black interior again more of a race style car so there's no back seats in it kind of weight reduction type of thing it's got the two bucket seats in the front and like I said I, I don't hate these wheels and they actually look good on this car but M2 has been putting them on everything wow definitely a modern engine in this one wasn't quite expecting that Hood opens nice and wide though, so you can definitely see that engine in there. Grills detailed nice, got the uh, headlight inserts in there. Hood closes good too, the Plymouth had some troubles with the hood staying closed. Got Ford Performance across the windshield there, GT on the hood. Another Ford emblem there. The blue has a little bit of metallic in it, it's not showing up very good, but it's there. Looks like there might be some in that gold as well. And before I put it on the turntable, I will try to wipe the fingerprints off of it from my fingers. So there's the base. I didn't mention it's got wider tires in the back, of course. Uh, 68 Ford Mustang used under license. Of course, with the BM2 um, Premium Edition, it's all die cast. 
It rolls pretty good. So I'll get it on the turntable for you. Like, comment, subscribe for more. Have a great day, and I'll catch you in the next video.